Submission number 16 and um, number 17 on page 20. Mr. Craig has an addendum. Mr. Craig, you may speak. You've got 15 minutes to speak to your uh, submission and you can leave your addendum as you go. Well, I'm going to start with the addendum because, of course, um, as it says here, uh, are you listening today? Uh, noting that the usual self located as to council, obfuscations of council issued information, re reserve status changes. Re dot the land and job work. Uh, also, number, point number two, the using old age pensioners, which of course is a the archaic sort of words, we are taxes paid hours, taxes, super annuals, thank you. Okay, and the reported housing needs. Well, I haven't seen or heard of it, say, uh, I'm going to survey from this council yet, but anyway. Mr. Craig, you are quite happy to be filmed. Oh, well, I'm fine, yes. Yes, good. Shall I stop? I won't. No. <laughs> <laughs> you start with it. Okay, so at point number three is you obscure the facts of consents required by all citizens, that's all of us, all the ordinary people, for any land use, building projects, um, and uh, the before the uh, South SWDC didn't do. I noted this fact to Christy Beach that it was absolutely ridiculous that you were putting us to all this bother and you haven't even sorted out the land use bit consent yet. Um, I refer you to the uh, Kishner housing program verb that you issued um, and it says the sorts of things, uh, steps to date, etc, etc, etc. And those steps to date and a few other things which I've put in my submission uh, a tantamount to us not having had any time to talk to you at all about long before now. Therefore, um, calling for objections, as I've said in my pre submission, um, which, as I agree, are very objectionable. And that you uh, now, at point number four, uh, also, you note the Auckland, the Surrey, uh, according to point number three. Due to before facts, which the government, as care of MP Mick Smith says, now seek allegedly to winkle through local government, so you're caught. And I have had this confirmed through the local government that these positions through all councils, all New Zealand, are all trying to do the same thing with various different bits and pieces of the land that have been utilised already uh, and here in Tokoroa has already got the kindy on, and has already got the senior system. So, that would be interesting, wouldn't it? Checked. Think about my submission, therefore, okay, is that, in the usual Trumpy style of elected self candidate council workings, for example, the make no improved mud hole. This works at increasingly $2 million debt over rate payments and rate from the debt. The predetermined pension and housing program Jeff, has reached a higher level in its arrogant diminution of the rights of rate payments. Decisions have been made since at least May 2015, if not long before. I recall some of the things that were going on at the time of our um, long term plan submission. Right. Uh, $1 million is also being sidelined. Organisations and planning instituted now. This is before we get here. Thank you very much. And as the previous lady said, who knew about it? This pretty little bird here says you've done it all. Thanks very much. So, you have made a uh, Council called for objections, and as above, is totally, I agree, objectionable. Such a move represses us, citizens electors, taxpayers, great powers, taxpayers, absolute rights, care of the Local Government Commission. Uh, absolute rights, right? Democratically comment and overview all and any local council workers. Effectively, the SWDC, we have elected, 
has adroitly limited our rights to make considered personal submissions. That is a I therefore put this as a submission to propose pension and housing in Tokarai, which we're now being asked about, I would presume, be developed in the Lake Moanui enclaved area, that's south of the lake, with access from Arrow Street, Tainui Street, and such development be subject to full contract process, which you are doing at the moment. Uh, as for such projects as rubbish bags, just put it on there. So that's simple. And the point about what your previous speaker said, I came in on, is that it's actually road hell at kindergarten parks. And it isn't when everybody's there much in the daytime. The kindy wouldn't know about it, and the senior sits might know about it. But in the night time, and uh, other times, there is a like a, like a junction in uh, the Auckland motorway. So I wouldn't wish that on any older persons at all. I'm saying about the back Island because that is a very nice spot, just edging on the country. And I know that most of us are pretty proud of country boys and girls at heart. So that's it, seen as we've now been asked. Right. Thank you. Are there any questions to Mrs. Craig? Mrs. Mrs. Craig, just one part of your, of your submission there. You've talked about um, putting this down at the, down the lake. Yep. Uh, and, but you add to that that it's a, it's a full contract process. Do I take it from that that you're not happy with the proposals we have at the moment to have uh, um, why we can school labour do the work to save money? All right, but what about all the rest of the people, like Ryan and all the rest, having to do through the consent process, and you just plonk around and then say, oh, we're just going to do it? Well, no, we have to go through those yes, processes. But, but, but I'm talking about the labour. You're going to do it. It's right here. You've done it. You've got it all arranged, and you're just going to do it. So don't give me that I'm, <laughs> I'm what? But I'm happy about it. Full contract process. Mrs. Mrs. Craig, mm. this is speaking you wrong. The only thing the council has approved in today is, to, is the idea of providing as much pension and housing as it can within the budget that's available. We haven't decided the site. Well, what you call us all standing here for? Then? Because we are asking for yeah. the uh, We haven't preferred site. That, uh, yeah, all right, don't double talk. That's all right. We all know what's going on, so that's fine. <laughs> Any further questions for Mrs. Craig? No I thank you for no your... No way! I'll oh, serve you like it, that was wonderful. Oh, you're Thank you. John Fire. We're paying our rates and a thin sum for all this.